Okay, things that I want to do right now is uh, replacing my bullet socket, the bu bullet socket on my battery pack uh, into this uh, XT60 socket, right? Like this, like this. So for this socket, uh, there is female and male. For this one is called male and this one is female. So for battery pack, I will use male socket rather than a eh, female socket rather than male socket because male socket might probably will get shot quite easily because we have two things out <coughs> here. So I go for female socket and uh, I also modified. I also have modified my multicopter to use uh, male socket on receiving this power source. Right. Okay, what we need right now is uh, first thing first is we have to cut our bullet socket one so uh, wire one by one. For this, I will go for the red, and then I prepare my socket over here, and then the flux soldering flux, and then soldering soldering wire, and uh, solder. Okay, let's on soldering iron. Okay, first thing that you have to do is uh, uh, we pre preparing our string tube. It will get heated and shrink. So what we do right now is uh, uh, for this is too long, so I divide it into two because we have two wires. Each wire we wish will use one. Okay. Okay, the next step is uh, quite simple. Just insert it into, and then uh, we connect our wire to the socket. Okay, this one is male. Uh, this one is male, and this one is female. So put it away. Okay, make sure you connect to correct polar. It's written over the cross cross meaning that it's positive so positive is red so what we need to do right now is uh, okay what we do need right now okay let me clean my soldering tips okay okay let hit Hit this thing first. Don't forget to put some of the flux. I think our soldering is not yet hot, so oh sorry. Okay, put a little bit more of soldering. Actually, the wire get should get heated over here, so it's easy for us to just connect it to our socket right now. So we. Wow. So I stick together. But I think I need to put a little bit more of soldering. Right. Just put a little bit of soldering over here. Sorry. Okay, I think it's good enough it's good enough right just inspect our connection first do it again try
look promising okay so next step will be the heat sink ah oh, no no sorry it's the the string tube just pull it back see whether it gets string or not okay okay for this i will use my uh a simple things that will so what i do is uh, just get the string first and then i pull in get the string and there we go so we have completed one of it right so here it goes so everything is fine so over here just make sure everything is okay so everything is okay right now right the next step is uh, what we do is uh, similar with the positive wire we just need to cut over here and connect it just like the one that we did with this red wire all we need to do is don't forget this uh, shrink tube put inside and then there you go we will have a connector with xt60 okay thanks for watching that's all